Nirmala Deshpande, the 17th of October 1929 to the 1st of May 2008, was a noted Indian social activist who had embraced Gandhian philosophy. She devoted her adult life to promotion of communal harmony and service to women, tribal people, and the dispossessed in India. She was awarded Padma Vibhushan, the second highest civilian award of India in 2006, and was awarded Sitara e Imtiaz posthumously by Pakistan in 2010. Early life and family Deshpande was born to Vimala, Vimala and Purushottam Yashawant Deshpande Purusatama Yasavanta Desapande in Nagpur on 19 October 1929. Her father was the recipient of a Sahitya Akademi Award in 1962 for his work in Marathi Animakachi Chintanika. She did MA in Political Science from Nagpur, India. She also studied Ferguson College, Pune. Thereafter, she served as lecturer in Political Science in Morris College, Nagpur. <laughs> Social activities Deshpande joined Vinoba Bhavi's Bhutan movement in 1952. She undertook a 40,000 km journey on foot, Padayatra, across India to carry Gandhi's message of Gram Swaraj. She recognized that it was difficult to practice Gandhian principles, yet believed that doing so was the only way towards a truly democratic society. Deshpande was known to be the spirit behind peace marches in Punjab and Kashmir when violence was at its peak in those states. Her peace mission to Kashmir in 1994 and her initiative in organizing India-Pakistan meet in 1996 were her two major public service achievements. The Tibetan cause against Chinese suppression was also close to her heart. She served as the president of a historical organization i.e. Harijan Sevak Sang from June 1983 to till her death. She was involved or associated with many other social organizations and bodies. And also, she founded Ukhil Bharat Raknatmak Samaj that won the National Communal Harmony Award in 2004. In 2006, Deshpande championed clemency for Afzal Guru, who had been convicted of a terrorist attack on Indian Parliament in 2001. The attack had resulted in the death of 13 people. Deshpande visited many cities in the United States of America on a tour organized by a prominent Indian American from Lansing, Michigan in the last few years of her life. She was member of a Raja Sabha when she died in her sleep in the early hours of the 1st of May 2008 in New Delhi at the age of 79. She continually worked for harmony between India and Pakistan. Even her mortal remains were immersed in Indus River of Sindh province in Pakistan. Topic: <laughs> Authorship Deshpande authored several novels in Hindi. Cement, on the theme of women's liberation, and Chimlig, based on Chinese cultural ethos, one of which got a national award, some plays, and travelogues. She also wrote a commentary on Isha Upanishad and a biography of Vinoba Bhavi. She also founded a magazine Nityanutan and started its publishing since 1985. This magazine was dedicated to world peace and non-violence and was one of the most effective magazine of carrying thoughts of non-violence and peace. After her death, magazine is being published every month through crowdfunding by one of her close associate Ram Mohan Rai, a social activist from Panipat, Haryana. Honours Deshpande was a nominated member of Indian Rajya Sabha two times during August 1997 to August 1997 and during 24 June 2004 to 2010. Her name was considered for the Indian presidential position in 2007. Deshpande received the Rajiv Gandhi National Sadbhavana Award 2005 and the Padma Vibhushan title in 2006. She was a nominee for the Nobel Peace Prize in 2005. Nirmala Deshpand G also received first Banarsi Das Gupta Rashtra Gaurav Paraskar on the 5th of November 2007 in a function present to her by Vice President of India Shish Muhammad Hamid Ansari in the presence of SMT Sonia Gandhi President Upa Shish Pawan Bansal Cabinet Minister Shish Shriprakash Jaiswal Minister of State Shish Bupinder Singh Huda Chief Minister of Haryana Shish 
Santosh Bagrodia, Minister of State, Shish. Deepender Singh Huda, Member of Parliament, Shish. Naveen Jindal, Member of Parliament, Shish. Ajay Gupta and many other VIPs at Balyogi Hall, Parliament of India, New Delhi. She was conferred the Sitara I Imtiaz, one of Pakistan's third highest civilian honours, on 13 August 2009, the eve of Pakistan's Independence Day. On her name, a small museum was established in Panipat Haryana with efforts of Ram Mohan Rai. This museum is like an honour and tribute and includes her belongings. <laughs> <laughs> 